Welcome along to another video presentation from Sat Alliance. My name is Robert Crane. If you find these videos beneficial, we would appreciate a donation towards helping us improve what we currently offer. To make donations, please go to donation.satinalliance.com.au. In this video, we'll have a look at the client part of the Trend Micro suite of products running on a small business server network. So on the desktop of a client that is connected to our small business server, we'll find that we have installed the Trend Micro client. You'll notice that this icon is blue with a yellow squiggly line through it. If we mouse over that cursor, we'll see that it gives us the current update version and engine version of Trend. Right mouse click on this icon to bring up a menu. First option we can select is to choose to update. Simply select this with our left mouse button and select the update now button. This will now go to the Trend Micro console installed on the small business server and retrieve any configuration updates as well as virus pattern updates from the server and download those and install those onto the client machine automatically. When complete, you will receive a message. Again, if we right mouse click on this icon, we have an option to unload the client server messaging agent. This is normally controlled via a password, which prevents users from inadvertently uninstalling the virus protection on their workstations. So to remove this, we would need to put in the correct password, which has been set by our trend console on our server, and then the trend client would be uninstalled temporarily from our client workstation until the next reboot of the machine. To actually run a virus scan, you right mouse click on the icon again and select Client Server Security, Security Agent Console. This will bring up the console and as you can see, we can see the drives that are currently on our machine. We can select any of these drives and we can select to scan. So again, we can choose to scan individual items and directories within our machine. Normally the easiest thing to do is to simply select the option down here that will scan our whole machine for spyware and greyware. So to enable this, simply click on the scan button and you'll see that the scanning now commence. During the scanning process, you will notice that the icon, the trend icon down in the system tray will become active. And when moused over, we'll say that it's scanning. If you wish to stop this process at any point, simply press the stop button located over here to terminate the scan. When the scanning process is complete, you'll see a message telling you whether any issues have been detected on your machine. You can easily deal with these from the console that is displayed. If nothing is detected, click OK to continue. To close this console, simply click the exit button. This has been another video presentation from Saturn Alliance. If you have any comment or feedback, please send me an email. robert at satinalliance.com.au Thank you very much for watching.